In the heart of Los Angeles, a quiet neighborhood is shattered by a night of terror as a desperate 911 call reveals a family under siege. A young woman, her mind clouded by drugs, wields a knife, threatening her own blood. The clock is ticking and the situation spirals out of control. What unfolds next is a chilling encounter that forces officers to make a split-second decision, a decision that will alter lives forever. A frantic call for help sends Mission Patrol Division officers racing to the scene. A volatile situation unfolds as a woman, driven by the demons of addiction, turns on her own family with a deadly weapon in hand. The stakes couldn't be higher as she traps her loved ones, leaving them with nowhere to run. The fear in the voice on the other end of the line is unmistakable, a desperate plea for rescue as danger looms ever closer. The chilling details of the 911 call set the stage for a tense and unpredictable confrontation. Yes, there's someone in, holding a knife in my home. Can you please come? No, no, no. What's your no, no, no. It's my Venice Boulevard apartment. Who is armed with a knife? Can I put knife? Uh, wait. Excuse me? The person that's holding the knife, who are they to you? Are you guys related? If, yeah, she's my sister. She, she's on drugs. What does she look like? White, black, Hispanic, or Asian? Hispanic. A color shirt? White shirt. Do we need an entry code to get into the building? Yes. What's the entry code? This. Do we, okay, your sister, she's threatening anybody with a knife or she's just holding she it? Has, yes, she held it in front of me right now. I had to lock myself in the room. Okay, stay on the line. It's going to sound like I disconnected, but I'm only getting the officers going, okay? Don't disconnect. Machine units with smart violence, email with mental illness, next to the ice boulevard unit. The entry code is going to be suspect is a sister, female, Hispanic, white shirt, armed with a knife, threatened the PR. The PR is locked in her bedroom. The uh, suspect is under the influence of unknown narco and 390 incident 0134 and RD 1966 semi for additional. The officers arrive, the weight of their duty heavy on their shoulders. Every second counts as they prepare to face the unknown, their hearts pounding with the anticipation of what lies behind that door. Uh, verify its apartment. Yeah, verify the PR seven now. 1979, it's unit. The PR is unable to sit out. She's locked in her room. The suspect is it. Let us out. Hey, let us in. Just come out with your hands up. All right, come talk, come talk to us and we'll go talk to them. Open the door. Open the door. You guys want to stay up here just for a hands team? Yeah. 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 Ma'am, open the door. Hey, do you guys have keys to the door? Tiene, tiene llaves. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna be that's gonna be the daughter's mom. Minor. Should be three Why do you want to help her? Just open the door. Alcohol. Just open the door. Training order against. Just open the door. Open the door. Uh, open the door and talk to us. Wait. I can't hear you. Can you open the door? I can't hear you, ma'am. Can you open the door? I can't hear you, ma'am. Yeah, but she's turning with the knife. So we can't do that. He's moving the door now, I'm seeing it. Can you let us in, man? We can't hear you. How are you Ma'am, can you open the door for us? Can you open the door? I can't hear you, ma'am. This is Joanne. Yeah, this is this is the mom of the daughter. So this, she doesn't really know. So yeah, she may Ma'am, can you open the door for us? We're just supervising. We're just supervising. We're fine. We're, 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 we're just here to make sure everyone's okay. Can you open the door, please? Everybody is okay. Well, I gotta verify that. Can you open the door, please? My thing is, I got the phone to the call. She doesn't live there. She's on with the knife. 
Little girl and mom. Yeah. We don't know anything else, right? Yeah. 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 So Sarge, we're gonna kick the door. We're going to do parkour from that room up the next one. There's no room. No, there is no room. Ma'am, open the door. She's banging on the door. Hey, if you don't come out with your hands up, we're going to kick down the door. You ready? Put your head, man. Over here. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. I drop the knife. I say drop the knife. Get back. Get back. Get back. Hold on. Get back. Get back. Get back. Hold on. Ma'am, open the door. She's banging on the door. She's banging on their door now. Okay, Roger, just advise the uh, PR that officers are making. All right, hold up. Hey, if you don't come out, your hands up. We're gonna kick down the door. You ready? Ready? Nice one. Hold on, let's get it. So you get out. Put your hands, Matt. Over here. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. I got it.
it's kind of default, so you gotta. You probably have to dunk it. Yeah. It's your hand, man. Over here. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. I Drop the knife. I said, drop the knife. Hold on, 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 Yeah, you got it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Grab it. All units, Commander 19 boys, responding close three from Mission Station to 19 from High School of Water Prevention. She's fine. She's fine. There you go. You got her? I got her. Yeah. Okay. Let's put her in a recovery position. She's... You're going to have to grab her from the other side. Yeah, I will. It's just because if we sit her up, she's going to slip because it's all water there. Yeah. So we got to find a place to sit her. She's still got the two. I'm going to move her. We still need to get them. I got her, partner. Yeah. 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 Yeah.